One of New Zealand's heroes of the early 70s, Alex Wiley came back for a tour of Wales and Ireland in 1989 as coach. His captain was to prove to be the best number eight in the world and certainly one who maintained the standards expected from an All Blacks captain. Wayne Shelford from Auckland Club North Harbour. By the time they met the Welsh at Cardiff Arms Park on the 4th of November, they'd already won six matches in Wales, scoring 200 points in the process. Wales took the field with Swansea scrum half Robert Jones as captain, but he was very much aware of the last time he'd played against the All Blacks, when they were roundly defeated in the World Cup quarter-final in Brisbane. Once again, New Zealand were rampant. As he's hoisted a high one up the touchline to Gary Owen. Jones waits, called for the mark, it's kicked on by Shelford. Shelford kicked away by Paul Thorburn. And what a, a nervous start there for the Welshman as Shelford almost got to the line. Will they go for a shove over? The Welsh have held them, bash up, and it's almost the young fella Craig Innes getting over. The referee has his hand up, the try is given, and New Zealand are ahead, and would you believe it, in his very first international, only his fifth game in an All Blacks jersey, Craig Innes has scored. What a debut. There's Gary Wetton, 40th international today. Kevin Phillips using Mark Jones at the tail. That was a super jump as well. Penalty against the All Blacks and uh, being rounder for maybe pulling it down. And he needs this for 200 points. Thorban looks very good. It's pinpoint. What a repost. Fast to Phil Davis. Phil Pugh held in half of New Zealand. Kevin Phillips went in, Jones, Clement, that's another monster, it's got snow in it, that one, Gallagher waits, Gary Wetton was back, Thorburn, oh, easy as pie, they're level at six points all, so David Young's had a ticking off for um, uh, a bit of uh, foul under the foul play lot. Three metres up to that crossbar. Grant Fox then. It's very casual and it's made it. He stroked it quite beautifully. Stanley, Gallagher, Gallagher is clean through, Gallagher feeding on the try for Bashup, and Bashup also has scored, the two new caps in the New Zealand side have scored tries on their debut, and that surely seals it for the All Blacks, 19 points to 6 there up. It is the feet wide apart, which is uh, unusual in a way, they'll step backwards and then plonk, flags are up again. There are times when you feel that Grant Fox can't miss. 21 points to six. Through there goes Sean Fitzpatrick again. Pick up by Murray Pierce, Basher onto Shelford. The Welsh 22, another lovely ball left, Basher, Fox. Fox to Schuster, Gallagher once again. Gallagher like lightning, out there for second try for Craig Innes. Oh, what a debut for the 20-year-old. Bashup, Schuster, Wolf, he's found a lot of space. And it's Emir who has to go back there with half a New Zealand after him. Look at Gallagher. Good fall by Emir. Good follow-up tackle by Innes. Now it's Gallagher. He's away again. Almost up to the Welsh 22. There's Errol driving on. It's Bashup once more. Out to the open side to Fox. The feed on to Stanley. Stanley onto McDowell, great tackle by Mark Jones, the pickup by Bashup, out to Brewer, this is Fox, Terry Wright, Wright is home. 29 points to nine, Grant Fox. That is how he goes through exactly the same routine, takes his time and then Wolf looks good, it is 
absolutely spot on and the All Blacks have won a convincing victory by 34 points to 9